Okay. Listen to me <clears throat> very carefully. I do not claim to know everything. I don't know everything. I am only a man in the world and I'm alive right now. I will die one day. I don't know when that day will be, but until then, I'm in reality. I'm here. But here's the thing. I get right into it. I don't have time to bullshit around. Did you, and I'm not taking sides in this video, but did you Christians and you evolutionists and you other religious people and creationists, did you ever think about this for one moment in your life? Did you ever think how there's so many people that if this is the split between both sides of the argument, how the Christians and religious people and creationists are on this side, and then over on this side is the atheists and the agnostics and other people that are hung up on there's no God or I don't know if there's a God. Did we ever take one second to see how, do you ever think that if there is a God that he did this on purpose to make us say like, okay, this side, some of what they say makes sense, but then it doesn't. And then some of this side makes sense, but doesn't make sense. You know, it, it's kind of, I'm not putting it in the terms how I want to say it, but it's, did you ever think for a second that it, it's so close, like, like me, I'm one of these people, I am right here. I am completely in between both sides. I am not on this side and I'm not on this side. So you kind of can't label me as anything, you know, I, I just, I don't believe in nothing really, you know, in my one video, I said about how I think that there is some kind of intelligence that brought this about, but I don't know. I don't no, and you don't know shit. I don't know shit. Why, why can't we just let our pride down and say that we don't know shit with our brains, with these brains? You know, we, we can know so many things, but that does not necessarily make us smart. But I can't get past this. It's kind of like a joke being played on everyone. Did anyone ever just sit and take one moment to realize this like is this some kind of joke being played on all of these creationists and evolutionists and atheists and it's all an ist 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 christianists you know if that's a word it's all ists evolutionists creationists you know, did you ever think that it's like some joke that's being played on all of you? <laughs> like, like, and I know you're, a lot of you might not be understanding what I'm, what I'm saying here, but you're so on one side that you're, you're never here. You're never here, like where I'm at. I've already investigated this side and I was already on this side. And then I've investigated this side and I've been on this side. And what it did is it made me see that it's like a, a game, like a joke being played. Like, uh, like God said, I'm going to make them think that we came from apes. And I'm going to let them think these foolish things and I'm going to let them go and I'm going to let them think what they think. And then I'm going to put these rules into play where you can't do this and you can do this. And, and I'm just like, like my mind just blows up thinking about this stuff. Like, 
Do you idiots? And, and listen, don't get offended. We're all idiots. We're all freaking idiots, okay? Don't think you're smart because you went to college and you know so many things. That doesn't make you smart. It's just you know something. Everybody knows something. Everybody knows something. You know, it's, have you ever read, you know, uh, philosophers and what they say? Have you ever read, you know, Marcus Aurelius, Seneca, Plato, and, and other men that have quoted things and what they say? You know, they say a wise man admits he knows nothing. You know, it, it's, are you, do you see these things? Like, it's, everything is a contradiction. Everything is, you, you say you know, but you really don't know. So, so who, you know, these labels that we put to each other and, and we say, oh no, this is the right thing. Oh no, this is not the right thing. Oh, well, what I'm saying is making way more sense than you. And, and, you know, we all have to be right. You know, we all have to be the right one. You know, it's like, do you ever just sit back and think and just laugh like I am in my mind and say, this is a joke. This is like one big joke and let laughter be the best medicine. You know, it's kind of like, no, I'm not laughing all the time and I'm not laughing in people's face and stuff, but I'm laughing at these ideas that we think makes us so smart and intelligent and we're not that smart and intelligent. We're just not. We are human beings. We have a limited capability. Yes, there is people that have made the spaceships at NASA and stuff. And how in the world they did that? I don't know because I am not a rocket scientist. I don't know things like that. Some men have it in their DNA to where they can do that. And they are, they have the ability to do that. But then in other areas, they can't do anything. They, they don't know shit. And then, listen, I'm a musician, and I was watching this video the other day of this guy. He can beatbox. He can beatbox his ass off. But he cannot hold a tune to a metronome. A t t t t boom. He cannot hold a melody, but he can beat boxes. I mean, he's like one of the best. He's like one of the best in the world, but he cannot. He cannot hold a tune to save his life. So none of us can call ourselves smart or intelligent because there is something that you do not know or you are not good at. Everybody has a weakness and everybody has a strength, some more than others, some way less than others. But it's like, here's what I'm saying with all this is I'm just seeing a bunch of prideful men trying to be right and saying that they have the answer and they know everything and I'm the smart one and you're retarded. You know, it's this constant labeling shit and this constant I'm intelligent and you're not and comparing. We're always comparing each other to things and see... Here's the weird thing about all this is that, yes, some of the Bible is bullcrap to me, but then there are things that are in the Bible that I completely agree with because I see men doing these things. It says compare, don't compare each other. 
and don't get into petty arguments and indoctrinations. Don't get into false indoctrinations and, and you know, uh, saved by grace through faith and not by works so that no man may boast. You know, it's constantly men boasting about how much they've worked and how right they were. And, and in reality, they're stupid. They're just stupid, but they don't want to admit. No one wants to admit that they're stupid or they're dumb or they're not intelligent. And I'm, I'm admitting that I am fucking stupid. I am dumb. I don't know much of anything, but yet I do know some things, but I don't know other things. So how can I call myself a smart man, an intelligent man? You see, it's Oh man, it, it's just prideful men that have an ego and prideful women that have an ego. They can't let go of things. You see, once someone has that religion or they believe in evolution or they are completely convinced of creation and all that, they cannot let that go because they cannot admit that they may have been or they are wrong. They're so scared to admit that they're wrong and that they failed or they did something wrong or they're stupid or dumb. They're so scared to admit it. I don't understand why we hold on to this. Who are we holding on to this for? Like, I could give a shit. If someone calls me stupid, so what? You call me stupid. If someone calls me an asshole, okay, you call me an asshole. You're an asshole too. Mikasa Sukasa, like, it's, it's the same shit. So why are we labeling and why are we comparing each other? You know, see, here's what I got to say with all this. I, I say in all, a lot of my other videos, I don't know much of anything. I can even sound like a hypocrite sometimes, and I say that I contradict myself, but there's nothing wrong with contradicting yourself because everything contradicts itself. Everything in this life contradicts itself. So, therefore, no one's really ever better fully. Maybe in like a situation, a certain situation, they might be right or wrong in that little bit of situation but besides that they're not nobody is so the thing is is that i have got a lot out of the bible i have got a lot out of the holy bible and but i'm not religious though see that's the thing i am not a religious guy I am not a Christian. I am not doing what all these other people are doing and, and the way they do it and all that. But there is things in there that make complete sense in this reality. But then there's other things that I'm like, th this is just crazy. It's lunacy, just like with the evolution and the creationists and a lot of what all the other ists people say you know and do we ever just sit and think about this do, do you are you so one-sided are you so one-sided one-sided are you so one-sided that you can't be here and you can't just take a look over here and over here at the same time and say is this a fucking joke is this is this a game being played just let me laugh about it. You, you know, it's just, let me just say, my goodness, this is like a game. You know, and I don't know. I just, I came to this point where I like discussing things too. And I like talking about things, but there comes a point to where it's just ignorant and stupid. It, it just comes to a dead end. And then people are arguing over the most petty, stupid things. Like, 
you'll have these people at these rallies together and then there will be an evolutionist there and then there will be a Christian there and then there will be some abortion people there and other people there and no, I don't agree with abortion and I don't agree with so much of this shit but the thing is, they'll start getting in these arguments and they'll start saying, oh well, you ordered, you ordered a chicken sandwiches for these people and it says in the bible you know you shouldn't eat this or that you know what whatever in this one video they were saying something about uh they were going back in the old testament in the bible and getting into that and using that as an excuse so the video cut off so thanks for watching